Okay. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm doing good. Did it hurt? Good. No, sir. So now we're going to empty this cyst. Let's see what comes out. Hopefully it'll stay up here. Oh yeah, it's coming right out. Ooh. Now I'm pushing on you. Do you feel much pressure? Yeah. That is white. <sighs> amount of material in that cyst. Now this is protein and oil is basically what this is composed of. Cool. Yeah, let's go ahead and remove that. Like a pimple? Uh, wow, it was like thick. Very like, thick. Almost in one come off. Very thick. Okay. So that came out. We're going to use a curved hemostat. We're going to open this up a little bit more. Now we're going to try to get the sack and the rest of this out for you, okay? Alright. You feel any pain? No. Okay. Got a good view there, Miss Gumby? Yes, sir. Gumby Jean. There we go. No dizziness, right? No. Okay. No, he's feeling good. He's like, get rid of this thing. <laughs> <laughs> start talking, start wearing hats all low. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> people are tired of, you're tired of people looking Staring at you saying, at what it. is that, right? Is that growth sticking up as this, off of his forehead? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Someone looks like a third was, eye. Oh. The old third eye kind. Like a minion? Yeah, right? Oh, that's <laughs> just mean. Mm -hmm. That's just mean. Yeah. The minion, huh? There we go. So now we're pulling the cyst. No kidding. It's great. Yeah, if <laughs> anything, yeah. The only thing it did was kept getting bigger, didn't it? Yeah. That's hard to grab onto. you got a slippery one in there. And it's on, a, on his forehead. Yeah. Oh, we're going to get a really good closure on this, though. It's going to look nice. Mm -hmm. Can't wait to take the stitch out. Yeah. That's Gumby's deal. She <laughs> gets I to had take a date stuff. tonight, but... <laughs> Did you? Oh, you can You're still, your have, oh, yeah, still look cute. Yeah, we'll see. No, don't be a baby. Nah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm yeah. sure she's going to look all over that stitch. I'm kidding. You, can tell, you can tell her you, it's some kind of you know, really I impressive uh, uh -huh. lesion. Yeah, I got in a fight with the bear. Yeah, yeah you won. The wild, animal. wild animal. Is that was just a stitch? You should have saw the bear. Right? See, it's kind of small. It'd be kind of small for a bear attack. Maybe we could say um, a kitten, a a, kitten. Wi a, wi <laughs> a wild squirrel oh. attack. Yeah. Who yeah. thinks of a That's wild, not cute. wild squirrel? Like, um, that is a macho. Me? Oh, okay. Just say a bear. No, a bear. No, she's never gonna believe. But he a bear. won. What about like a bobcat or something? So the bear yeah. didn't get to do it. A wild cat. A bobcat. It's okay, a bobcat. more yeah. like a kitten. I don't know, but you know what would help me, Miss Gumby Jean, is if you would dab here for me. Okay. I don't want to block the camera. Well, I know. Probably go over his other shoulder. If you could go ahead and dab that for me. More. Okay. Yeah. There we go. So this is a highly vascularized area, so it, they do tend to bleed more. Mm -hmm. So even though we use the epinephrine to help prevent the bleeding, we still have some bleeding. But you can see where that cyst is, is very well encased. This is going to come out nicely. You don't have to worry about any recurrence of this cyst later on, and that's the important thing. Watching out for doors. <laughs> That's right. Please. Just watch out for more doors in the future. That's right. Good. Right there. Soft. Just a little bit. There's all kinds of tugging going on up there. I can't feel anything. <laughs> <laughs>
Just about done, my friend. Okay. I know there's more right there. See that? Yeah. See that gummy gene? That's cyst. If we don't get that out, my man here is going to have this thing come back later, and then he's not going to be happy, and we don't want that to happen. <laughs> we want him to be happy, right? I'm running out of my four by fours over here. We're gonna do a little flush now. Here we go. Let that bubble out. Make sure we got everything out of there. I'll tell you what. Uh, that door did a number on you, didn't it? Uh -huh. I think you're gonna get three little stitches and a band aid mm -hmm. and a lollipop. Right. All the way out of here. What do you think? Does that sound good to that you? Sounds good to me. Do you really want a lollipop? <laughs> no, he doesn't really want a lollipop. Only if it's a blueberry. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I probably, I think I can You got a, do you got a blueberry lollipop? Mm -hmm. Oh, I love those pineapple dum-dums. They still oh, make those in the butterscotch yes. ones? Those are good. Butterscotch, pineapple, and the blueberry are awesome. Oh, One stitch down, my friend. All righty. Here, you need these. Did you take my scissors? I did. I was You were going to cut? Well, be a little wet up here. We're just kind of cleaning the area a little bit. Okay. You're not hurting, right? No, sir. We're done with all. Now we want to take these out in about five days. So this is Thursday, right? Yes, sir. So I want you to come back on Tuesday. Tuesday. Okay. Did I count right, Gummy yes. Jean? Thank you. This is 50 ethylon? Yes. Cut? You want to cut? Right there. Good job. Don't put anything on them, just we want them nice and dry. Okay. Uh, so I'm to take a shower, put some plastic over it or something? Well, we'll have a dressing over it. Yeah, you want to put a, a, a bandage over it when you get in the shower, okay? okay? You want to keep this area clean and dry. That's the best way to do it. Okay. And action! Stay tuned for the Midget 7 video. Totally and it cut up. and back. Go back. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm Tara and I just wanted to talk to you really quickly about Meta 7. So I have a condition called PTSD, Post Traumatic Stress Disorder, as well as several anxiety disorders. And um, I was housebound in my house for three years. Um, with the help of a bunch of doctors, I got that under control. I'm working really hard. But no matter what we did, the doctors, me, nobody could figure out my serious fatigue during the day and my inability to sleep at night. So one day I'm watching a video just like this one, go Dr. Gilmore, and um, I decided to just go for it. Um, and I am so happy I did. I was worried about the energy level, whether it would make me feel anxious or jittery. It's natural. It's amazing. I feel motivated to get out and do things that I didn't before. I'm... Um, I'm just out, I'm hanging out, I'm I'm doing things, I'm living again. My service dog, Wilhelmina, is just like knocked out right now because she's getting so many walks and we're getting out and doing so much. So thank you so much for Meta7, Dr. Gilmore. And um, if you're watching this and you're wondering, get the 90 day supply, forget the 30 because you're gonna love it. Okay, bye. Hey folks, check out this 24 karat gold anti-wrinkle beauty peel mask. It's the latest and greatest in skincare that's worked its way over from Asia. They're somewhat similar to the activated carbon blackhead peel masks, which focus more on deep pore cleaning and tug on the skin a little bit harder upon peeling. The gold mask focuses more on skin smoothing and the gold itself helps to replenish collagen and accelerate collagen renewal. So for smoother, healthier skin, try this 24 karat gold peel. Check out the link below. I felt really smooth. Fresh, refreshing. Skin feels freaking amazing. It's soft. It's like you can feel the pores are like straight. This is good. I like it. Check out Dr. Gilmore's seven piece kit.
It's compact in size with a leather case, perfect for traveling, and available on Amazon for under $20. See link below.